Hey guys, it's Unbridge Girl Kiki back with another one. So y'all know last week I covered um, August Alcina's uh, interview with Angela Yee. And um, lo and behold, Jada has come on with the interview with her and Ed Will at the Red Table Talk. And y'all know that's her um, her show that she does usually with her mother and her daughter Willow. So um, anyway, so I watched the interview. It was only like 13 minutes. And um, she pretty much said that a rep came out and said that an affair with her in August never happened. But her nor Will ever said that, you know, a relationship with, with uh, August never happened. So they decided to come out and just pretty much just put it all on the table, the red table, because, you know, it's just one of those things that's kind of getting out of control. So it's like, you know, address it so that it could kind of clear the elephant out the room, I guess. So, um... Basically, she was saying four and a half years ago, her and uh, Will had basically like split up. Well, as Will so eloquently put it, he was done with her ass. And um, they separated for a period of time. And during that period of time, her relationship with August transformed from a platonic relationship to a romantic relationship. But Jada says that, you know, she was so broken and just hurt and stuff like that and I guess from her relationship with Will and um she just wanted to feel good cue the the Holly Berry and Monsters Ball moment right anyways so um she basically admitted she kept calling it an entanglement okay she's like yeah I had an entanglement with August and then Will's like yo listen what is it what what, what really happened like now I'm about to I'm he basically like you know he's in her shoes so he he the host of the red tape so he's like so what what did we what did we do what did you do and so she's like you know he's like you had a relationship and she's like yeah I had an entanglement he's like you had a relationship and he, she's like yeah I had a relationship with August and basically you know in her relationship with August you know they she she said she learned a lot about herself and she was basically healing from whatever issues that she had with will so this kind of basically turns into a, a hurt people hurt people moment so like you know august the young and falling in love with this lady and you know actually being in like a full-blown relationship with her when like it kind of just seems like Jada was looking for some like a distraction, something to make her feel more or just feel different than she had been feeling in her relationship with Will Smith. So well, Jada says that there's no way that Will could have gave her permission because the only person that gave permission in a situation of that sort is herself. So she didn't need Will's permission to go get into a relationship with August. She decided to be in a relationship with August. But she does she also doesn't call it an affair because to her, her and her and Will weren't together. So it's only an affair if you're like currently in a relationship, right? She pursued a different, a new relationship with August. Meaning, you know, there was no affair, but it was a relationship of sorts. So um, basically, the whole getting what's blessing thing was boils down to this. He kind of, you know, went to Will, whatever, and they had a discussion, and then it was within, you know, him and or I mean August and. Jada, you know, embarked on this relationship that they had. So what happened was, you know, in the interview, how basically he said, like, you know, she butchered his heart, broke his heart, broke it down after he devoted everything to her. Basically, Jada got over whatever it was. You know, she 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 was she healed herself. She you know got rid of some old wounds and started feeling better about the relationship and the life that she lived with with Will Smith. And decided to, you know, obviously she wasn't gonna she wasn't gonna leave her husband. It's kind of like like um when like a side chick is dating a married man, and he's like, yeah, baby, I'm gonna leave my wife for you. Yeah, baby, I'm gonna leave my wife for you. We gonna live together. We gonna have you know a relationship, but we gonna live happily ever after. And then she always like, baby, when you gonna leave your wife? Baby, when you gonna leave your wife? Don't worry, I'm gonna leave. Don't worry, I'm gonna leave her. I'm not saying that's what happened. With, like that's the, the 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 dialogue between August and Jada, but it's pretty much kind of like in that area, cause it's like y'all think about it, like she's married, she gets in a relationship, cause they having some little midlife crisis thing, like like people do or whatever, and then you think, okay, well we in this relationship, we loving each other, you know, we having some deep meaning and whatever, like we got this connection, this bond with each other, so you August is thinking that you know 
we gonna be together. But and he kind of sets up a self of a fairy a little bit because they've been together for like what twenty well twenty five years now. But but at the time they were together for twenty years when when August and Jada started their little relationship. So y'all think about it. It's like I said, like the married man who's not gonna leave his wife, but tells the side chick I'm gonna leave my wife. So yeah, think about it. So you so gotta think about Jada and Will was separated. So it's like okay, y'all not together, so we together, and we gonna be together, and that's what it's gonna be. So then she basically is like, well, I'm not leaving my husband. You know what I'm saying? Like I come to a realization, like we in this for the long haul, and la la la. So she said at that point, August cut off communication with her. So he she broke his heart. He removed himself from the situation. And right around that time that that happened, his sister passed away. So it was kind of was like all happening in one, you know, one big thing. So Jay says she hasn't spoken to August since, you know, they've cut off their romantic relationship. And um, basically, she, they, she admitted it. They admitted they broke up for a little bit. She went, she had a thing with August. But you can't kind of, you kind of really can't call August her side thing because her and her husband were separated. But even still, I, technically, y'all still married. And y'all knew y'all wasn't going nowhere with each other. So, it was still, to me, it's still in the fact because y'all still married. But, um, you know, Will Smith said he, was, he had been done with Jada for... For you know a little bit, and you know they basically made an agreement where she would go try to figure out how to make herself happy. He would try to go figure out how to make himself happy. Now, in the end of this though, the end of the interview, uh, Will Smith was like, you know, I'm gonna get you back. And Jada's like, well, I don't think it's about getting anybody back. And, J and Will Smith was like, yeah, but for me, it's 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 about it's for getting you back. But Jada almost spilled a little bit more of tea. He was like, well, I think you've done, and you've got me back a few times and then she stopped so you know we, everybody know Will Smith had his little whatever with whoever during the course of their relationship so they've been, been together for 25 years now so they basically sitting there did an interview with each other saying exactly what was going on with this and admitting that this thing actually happened and they're like oh well it's strange that it's coming out now and this that the third the thing is it's not really strange that it's coming out now because, uh, you know, August ain't been out for five years. See, I think about it. Right around the time when all this happened with Jada, he, he wasn't putting out anything. He wasn't doing interviews. So it kind of makes sense that it's coming out now because now he's like, well, okay, well, this is what's been going on for the whole time that I've been, you know, missing out the, out the scene, off the scene. So it to me, it does make sense. Probably to another makes sense. like, yo, this happened that long. Now you just not saying something. Because I think that... Again, it wasn't August's intention to be like trying to put people's business out there. Yes, it's a private matter. But again, the same way that Jada had to do her healing and things like that, maybe this is just his, this was his way of you know letting out everything that he needed to let out so that he could fully heal and fully you know become the person that he's trying to be. So um, again, he ain't put out my like five years. So he put out the documentary and then he put out the album. And this all is part of his story. So I don't think it was, because that's the thing, because if he was really trying to do it for clout, wouldn't he have done it, like, wouldn't he have done it right when, you know, they broke up, he would have came out like, yeah, I was I was with Jada, and this at the third. Like, I feel like if someone was being malicious and had malicious intent, that is what would happen. Like, they would sit there and be like, yo, I was with her on some Ray J, I hit it first type business. But, um, yeah, so there you have it. He was waiting for Jada to come to the red table and do the talk, and she did her will. And um, we know now we know what happened. That's it for this one. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.